Magnagas Corporation is a clean technology company. We're based in Florida. We have operations throughout Texas and California. We basically do two things. We produce a renewable metal cutting fuel that's used throughout heavy industries, ports, almost anyone that basically cuts and manufactures with metal will use our products safely and uh, at scale. We also are uh, working on a technology to allow us to sterilize um, animal waste, agricultural waste, and a whole host of other wastes that are commonly produced um, primarily in the agricultural space, but we're also working on applications for the municipal waste. Well, first off, the, uh, the process has been extremely successful. We've been very fortunate that we identified companies that had excellent people, and those people were able to help us springboard into uh, new parts of the country that were uh, loaded with potential for new customers of our metal cutting fuel. Um, so it, for us, it's always about identifying companies with excellent people that can help us to integrate, uh, work with the customers, and then deliver our technology very efficiently into new markets. And that's gone extremely well. So for us, uh, being in these new markets, primarily California and Texas, was very important. Uh, these are the two largest markets in the United States for our product, and um, to be to be meaningful in those two markets is important. So would I say that we're going to do lots of new acquisitions? Potentially, but not necessarily for the sake of doing an acquisition. It's more important to say, how can we efficiently become relevant in the best markets in these two regions? So obviously, Los Angeles has enormous potential. Houston has enormous potential, as does Dallas. So if there's efficient ways for us to become relevant in those markets, we have to be prudent with our capital, and we have to be prudent with how we get access to those markets. We're actually very excited with the time frame on our commercialization and sterilization. Um, as we just put out a press release on Monday, we talked about the fact that we um, have a very clear understanding as to what it's going to take from an approval process for us to um, commercialize our technology in North Carolina. We think it will take only a matter of eight to ten months, and then we'll be up, running, and fully functional in that state. And it's an enormous opportunity for us. Um, that market in the United States for the specifically for the cow, the uh, excuse me the pig market is enormous. Over 15 million tons of waste that needs to be dealt with annually, and we can solve that problem for them very efficiently. So. It, it's sooner than we think and larger than people would believe. That's another area where it's not far away and it's quite exciting. So we, uh, we've been very fortunate that we've got a very good partner that's helped us with uh, identifying some opportunities for them in the medical field. We think that we may even be commercialized with them by the end of the year. Well, I'm here in London, so... Mm -hmm. I uh, couldn't be more timely or current. Uh, we're very active in Europe. We find the market here very, very exciting. Uh, London has been an absolutely brilliant place to identify good partners, uh, good economic opportunities. We've also identified um, similar opportunities, primarily in Netherlands and Belgium. Those two markets are extremely green. They're always looking for innovation, and we've been very fortunate that uh, we've been connected to the right people. So we feel that Europe has enormous potential for us and it'll most likely happen very, very soon.